Hi slappers, welcome back to another slap based lesson and to those who have been missing this slap tutorial, if you're a beginner you want to start how to slap, I also do private class lessons, just DM me on my private lesson, okay? So guys, grab your base and let's begin with the tutorial. Okay, so let's begin with the tutorial, but I'll try and make it short, okay? So we'll be playing on key G, okay? We'll be using the thumb and the technique on how to mute the sound and also a ghost note okay so we'll be looking at these three things many of you know how to do it you can just slap on it and how to mute it and how to use this same thumb to ghost note on on it okay so let's look at what i'll be giving you Okay, so this is, let's say, an exercise I'll be giving you. I'll be adding the backing track at the end of this video, okay? So that is what I'll be doing to all of my lessons. So even in case I do any lesson that you want a backing track, just watch the end of the video. The backing track will be available for you. Then you can also practice with it, okay? So after we have learnt it, we will now apply it to the backing track and see how it will sound, okay? So first of all, what are we looking at? on your E string, let's thumb on it just two times, okay, just make sure that your timing is working perfectly, okay, so E string, okay, so let's say roughly we are playing on 6, okay, okay, you understand, so you see that when I thumbed on it, so if you want to mute it, you see so it is in two ways whether you want to keep it long or you want to make it short you understand okay so it is your choice okay but for me i prefer making it long you understand okay so let's look at that so on your e string just thumb on it then use your palm, that is your right, your left hand, just place it on top of the string. Just like you just, you just want to make sure that no sound will come out from this bass. So, you see, you understand? So, okay, or you can do it the long way. So now let's move to the other note. So, so now your A string, this is what you'll be playing on your key G. So you play your five flat. And your five but before we play that note we'll be doing a ghost note so on your e string then you mute then you ghost note using that thumb alone on your a string you understand so okay tom tom you mute ghost note two times then you you thumb when you press your five flat okay okay da, da. so when you press your five flat you now hammer on to your five so okay you understand okay so take it slow What you did on your A string, that is on your five flat to your five, do that same thing to your um, your five and your six. So that is your five six, okay. So when you don't play your six, it goes note two. Then you hit your E string. Okay, so this is what I want to show you today. So as you are practicing this exercise, just stay focused and make sure that when you are thumbing on any note, make sure that the note comes out very clean and very well, okay?
okay so i just said i wanted to use the thumb only so that practice master on how to thumb very very well okay okay so now let me join it to the backing track and see how it goes So I think this is what I have for you today, okay? So I'll be seeing you guys next week. Bye for now.